Good morning, Mor Northern Michigan. I'm Holly Baker, and I'm live in the studio with Pam East, a wonderful master pumpkin carver. So why don't we start with a little, why don't you tell us a little bit about how you take a picture and get it to a pumpkin. Okay, one of the, the coolest things I do are, are uh, celebrity portraits and, okay. and people that everybody sees all the time. And it really isn't that difficult to do when, if you've got a little bit of computer skills, you just take somebody's picture and then you turn it into a black and white photograph. Okay, it just says grayscale, turn it into grayscale. And then you, the brightness and contrast. You take the brightness and contrast and play around with them till you get something that's really close to what you'd see as a pumpkin pattern. And then the better you get, you can add a little more shading in, a little less contrast. And so it might be a little bit of trial and error before oh you yeah. really get what you want from your pumpkin. Yep, but like there, there's a pumpkin of Johnny Depp here, and he's all contrast. It's There's no Johnny shading. Depp. That's that one. Well, it's actually Jack Sparrow. Oh, but, you know, okay. It's, <laughs> Um, but there's uh, no shading in that one at all. And then the more you do it, and the, the better you get at it, and the more you play with it, you get the more shading. It can be some really cool effects. Are you going to do any uh, carving for us here today? Sure. I was going to plan on so doing this is like Thomas the Train. Okay. Yep. That's a typical pattern that you'd get anywhere off the Internet. There's several places. Um, I look at the things like tattoos, um, oh, okay. make great patterns, scroll saw pumpkins. You know, anything where a scroll saw would work. That makes for great patterns, and, and pretty much if you, if you do a lot of pumpkin carving, you walk around in life finding pumpkin patterns and everything. Find so. them anywhere you look, you might find a new pattern Absolutely. for your pumpkin. Absolutely, yeah. <laughs> All right, well, when we come back later, we might have some local celebrities carved into one of our pumpkins, and I'm referring to Melissa Smith. And um, so, back to you.